guys welcome back to my channel and welcome to taraji beauty shop my name is janet so today we are going to discuss how and where to apply your perfumes and the mistakes most of us make when we apply the, the sorry the perfumes and actually it's just the do's and the don'ts okay so let us see um first of all i'll take you through the types of perfumes that we have because it depends with the concentration. You can find that some are very potent compared to other perfumes. So we have like, um, you, the perfume, or the perfume. <laughs> yeah, these are French names, so just uh, bear with me. These are eau de perfume, and we also have uh, eau de toilet. Eau de toilet, it's less potent compared to eau de, eau de perfume. Okay, so I hope I've pronounced actually correctly because these are French names. So, um, odor toilet, it's very pot, it's less potent compared to odor, odor perfume. So, um, we also have oil based perfumes which are very, very potent. So, the more the oil, the more stronger the perfume is. Okay, so, um First of all, the mistakes that you, you shouldn't do are when you apply the perfume. Uh, some, let me just explain using the oil base. Let me see, let me just use this one. This one is oil based perfume. When you apply like this on your hand, what you should do is that you, can, you just dab, okay? Just dab like this. Don't rub like you're washing your cloth. Don't rub because when you rub it, it produces a lot of heat and it evaporates faster. So just um, dab. When you dab, then you can apply at the back of your ear, just like this, okay? Or on your neck, just like this. So I'll explain, so let's do this. Now this is oil-based perfume. It's very potent compared to the other uh, alcohol-based perfumes. So what you do, you just apply a little bit on your elbow then from there, you can just dab at the back of your ear, just like this. So we can go to um, Odor Perfume. This one is very, very strong compared to Odor Toilet. So um, the stronger the perfume, the less number of spray. Now this is just a spray. The less number of spray you can spray on your cloth or at the back of your ear. Uh, most people prefer at the back of your ear, when you know when you hug someone, the, you can smell good okay so um you just do like this i'll just explain uh, you just do one then two just like that some uh prefer spraying in the hair those with long hair some of us i don't know what you do but if you have long hair it tends to last longer but still, this is not like, um, it's not a mask that it has to be hair. We know we have hair sprays, but still, this one can still work if you want to maintain the same brand. So this is what you just do, like this, at the back of your hair, and some will spray on your neck, just like that, okay? Then others, if you have a long, a short sleeve, a short sleeve uh, top, you can just spray on your elbow, just like that then just like that and if you have your a short dress sorry if it's a dress not a trouser whether it's short or long you spray at the back of your knees once once yeah just like that okay so those are some of the uh, that is how you can apply on your body some if you have a chiffon top if you have a chiffon top you know it tends to be very light let's start with the oil perfume the oil perfume you just spray uh, like this way going down now the oil perfume then this way uh, but if your cloth is thick you can just spray once huh? just like this once then once just like that and still if you also have this alcohol based perfume actually the difference between the alcohol based and the oil based it's just the concentration. In the alcohol base, it has more of water and alcohol. It's more diluted. Actually, oil, we just have a small percentage of oil. But for the oil base, the oil is more, more 
compared to the other ingredients actually the main ingredient is the oil and the oil uh, tends to be more stronger that's why um, most people you'll find out that the oil perfumes the oil refill most of us call them refills they're very stronger compared to this other alcohol based perfume so this one you'll just spray still um, I've explained about don't rub those are the don'ts make sure you do not rub the perfume on your hand don't do it like you rub a lot you just dab you just dab like this and you do this okay yeah so on your cloth you can still spray one two yeah one two then um, in your armpits like this but don't spray a lot if you know your the concentration is higher or your perfume don't spray more yeah some but for other perfume if you spray it's actually like eight times stronger compared to this one this one is less by five so you can spray at most for other perfume just spray at most five times and for the sorry this is other toilet for the other toilet just spray at most um, eight times and here at most five times okay because you can choke people you know you have to be considerate about other people you don't get into a matatu some of us that use matatu don't choke people or if you get into the shop don't um, make people get uncomfortable because of the um, concentration you know if it's more concentrated just make sure you just spray uh, just uh, don't spray much just a little okay so we've been covering more about the ladies perfume uh, how to spray but still our uh, men also use a uh, perfume so let me just explain how men can spray the perfume so most of the men uh, colognes is a um, odor toilet most of them they use odor toilet so this is how you're going to do it you're going just to spray one not uh, the distance should be not so far not so close so it should be um, one then two then at the collar if you have a shirt you can spray at the shirt but if you have a t-shirt it's still okay then three four okay and before you do that one thing I forgot to say is apply a moisturizer on your skin because some people tend to have a sensitive skin so before even you wear perfume on your skin make sure that you uh, you have applied a moisturizer but if you have sensitive skin don't um, apply the perfume especially the alcohol based perfume but the oil based perfume is still okay you can still do that even for the men you can still apply like that then uh, you can also use the if it's a roll-on oil based most of them they normally come in a roll-on bottle you can apply one then two just like that and if you have sensitive skin just um apply on your shirt just like that one two or t-shirt whatever you have caught whatever it is then also it's advisable also for men you can spray at the back of your neck so what are the advantages of uh if you spray uh this side uh, behind the ears is when you hug someone they'll feel like you smell good and of course if you smell good they'll compliment you and you also feel great okay and at the back of your head when you like you walk towards a certain way um of course you leave a nice smell behind so that's about the men so another thing that you have to consider when you store these perfumes um let's say don't store, store it where, where there is heat because it will mess with the concentration just make sure um if you're at home don't store it near the window because if you store it near the window what will happen is the sunlight will add uh, will um, mess with the concentration so it's about the storage make sure you store where the temperature is good okay so that's how you can spray your perfume i hope i've explained well but if you feel there is there are other places you can spray you can share in the comment section so thanks a lot for joining me remember to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe like and share and always remember at taraji beauty shop we inspire you to smell good and feel great thank you